and they, they have nothing but good things to say. And you know, we've proven ourselves to, to be a really a, a force in the nation. And uh, but honestly, it's really, man, it's really just about this team and the love we have for one another and all the hard work we put in. And uh, you know, you never, you never really know what's going on behind the scenes, but just know we working and we got coaches that's on our, that's on us, on us as men and players. And um, it's just been truly an honor to be a part of this. Well, I would just say that, you know, I, I'll let everybody else do all the comparing and all that stuff, but they're the best right now, uh, and and they're the they're the best in the in the nation, uh, they, and they've played great people. You know, there was there was. Uh, uh, you know, a time where these guys were inexperienced and had to grow up and all that, and now you look up and, you know, 42 wins in four years. They, that 1990 group was the last time Clemson was number one in defense, and they broke all their records. More wins, and not only more wins, but the most ranked wins ever in a four-year period. And then, ironically, this is the largest margin of victory tonight in a bowl game, and they broke that 1990 record. Uh, so them 1990, they don't like these guys. Uh, you know, scratch them off their Christmas card list. But yeah, this is a special group, you know, and, and we can argue about who was the most talented, but, but collectively as a group and a team, this was, this was a fun group of guys to, to come to work with every day. And, you know, and our coaches uh, are awesome. You know, Coach V, Coach Brooks, Coach Hobby, Coach Reed. Those guys uh, are tremendous. Our support uh, staff, they all have done an uh, outstanding job. So uh, y'all can do all the comparisons. All I know is they're the, they're the best uh, today. All right, two more questions for Clemson. momentum booster for everyone uh, getting rolling off like that starting off uh, seven and seven and nothing right off the bat out of the first play and you know knew that it was one of the big plays you know it all comes down to who makes the big plays in the game and you know we had the most this game and starting off on the first play is a huge momentum booster and it's just it just kind of piled on from there and just kept going and uh, you know we really didn't hit the brakes from there one thing I'll say about Cole is kind of an interesting thing. Uh, Bray was telling us there's, o there's only been three quarterbacks ever to throw for 300 yards in a bowl game. And uh, you talk about sometimes how things are destined, but uh, one of them's Taj Boyd, one of them's Cole Stout, and the other one's a funky old quarterback named Brandon Streeter, uh, who we just hired to coach our quarterbacks about three weeks ago. So uh, pretty, pretty uh, ironic. Uh, that, that he joined uh, that group with Streeter and, and Taj Boyd. Uh, pretty neat. Yeah. Well, again, you, you don't just replace, you know, Grady Jarrett's a great player. I mean, we, we can replace great players, but man, boy, when you lose a great player that's that's a great man, I mean, you got to make sure you, you, you're bringing the right type of people in your program. 
great players, great people, and that's what we got a bunch of them guys, the Robert Smiths, the Grady Jarrett's, the Stephon Anthony's, Vic Beasley's, Corey Crawford's, Tavares, I mean, even Tony Stewart's, Gary Peters, I mean, Martin Jenkins, just some great men, Deshaun Williams, Josh Watson. Um, but we've recruited well, and, and if you know anything about us and as far as how we play, we play a lot of people, always have. I mean, Grady's unselfish. You know, he comes out of the game. Corey Crawford, he comes out of the game. Vic Beasley comes out of the game because we want to get Shaq Lawson in there and Dodd and, and, and all these other guys. Um, uh, we've got Carlos Watkins and, and DJ Reader and Kellen and Boulware and, and, and uh, BJ. So we, we, we play a lot of people. Uh, we'll be, we'll be – we're starting over basically uh, and we'll be a little different next year as far as our depth. I think we'll be very talented with our front line group. But our depth will be talented, but a little inexperienced as opposed to this year. This year we were deep, talented, and experienced. And, uh, you know, next year I think we'll be deep, we'll be talented, we just won't be quite as experienced. All right, thank you, gentlemen, and congratulations on